today. It's going to be boom, boom time, baby. Hey, hey, come on. Come pitch it up. So we're here. Got to make sure you sign in at the uh, sign in station. Simple, it takes like five minutes. Make sure you do it though. When you sign in, make sure you take the bottom half of this copy. Somebody did not, they actually left. They took the bottom, but they left the top. So hopefully they have another card or something, but make sure you sign in. That's how they know that you're here. That's how they know how to appropriate funding, I think, for each one of these units. Really important. You ready, Justin? Ready. He's got his light on his head. Ready He's go. ready. I'm ready. <laughs> Hopefully nobody's in our little sweet spot back here. Oh yeah. The honey hole. Montino. How many Justin? What do you think? I'm hauling out two limits this morning. Limits. Limits. <laughs> limits. We'll see y'all in a little while. Shot him, but he's dead. <laughs> nice job, dude. Boom, boom, boom. That was was that the same one? I don't know. I don't think it was. I don't either. I think the other one landed. So we got a possible five. Possible five, four confirmed. I know. Dude, I was looking up in the air and I looked up and I was like, holy crap. It's like pooping in her face. No, uh, not too bad, but we're doing pretty good. Yeah. When I was out here yesterday, I, I was kind of down. <laughs> now we just need that wad to like finish off that limit. Yeah. Two shots, eight birds. Hopefully we have some more groups working this evening or uh, here in the next hour or so. Justin might want to stay till what? Noon, Justin? Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> might as well get the full benefit. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you're here already, right? Yeah. Teal, typically, if you're going to teal hunt, you're going to need to uh, sit down and be here before daybreak. <laughs> Key number one, huh, Jess? Yeah. Don't get, don't get to the teal hole at shooting time. There is no second flight. They fly from shooting light till probably the first 30 minutes of the day is the heaviest and then it's a trickle effect maybe for an hour tops after that. So like by nine o'clock 
you should be done hunting teal. You can hunt all day. You might pick up a couple more, but most of the activity is right at daybreak. So it's not like big ducks where you can sit out there and at 9.30 to 10.30, you're gonna get a second flight of birds flying in. Just, it's not typical, but they do fly around a little bit still. It's just not like it is at daybreak. So we're gonna hang out, see if we can't find some more pretty quick, hopefully. Behind you, behind you, behind you, behind you, Justin, behind you. Look over. Good shot. Nice shot, dude. Hey, we found him. <laughs> oh. Hey, right there, right there. Hey, he's coming back, Justin. Go pick up these three. I thought you picked you picked up two. Oh. I thought you shot one and then two. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see your one right there. Huh? That's the only one I hit. Oh, okay. I thought you shot... Beautiful bird. Yeah, that's pretty. Came in. We just weren't there waiting on him. the drill hang next to the parking area don't <laughs> fly all morning <laughs> <laughs> don't go just don't go wow. is that model ducks yeah, what is it's that be like model. a pair of model ducks yeah. you think they if they're here they would nest here right yeah you would think so oh they're not even in frame there they are What's that s thing I've seen that the guy oh, works at cool. that s thing a little buckhead and buck doe Seen that before? No. 
maybe sportsman or something. Just preening, you know, no big deal. Yeah. Probably, man, I'm really worried about those teal this morning. <laughs> flying around. Crazy guys. Tried talking them out of that flying around, so. <laughs> just won't listen. Man, they have not moved 20 feet since yesterday. Are they are they on a string? Someone got them as decoys? <laughs> <laughs> Somebody laying up in that grass over there? Dude, they I have no has a thing, it's a camouflage faux pas. You need to match the environment you're in, okay? Tree bark waders, uh, marsh environment, I mean, I don't know. It just it's just a duck's you gotta, care. Yeah, they they, they definitely do, do. They're 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 they watching care. and if like you're in last season's number one color, I yeah, mean they know. They know the new trends. You're <laughs> You're not gonna shoot ducks. They're not giving their life up for Max 3, dude. No, oh no, <laughs> no our no. Advantage Wetlands. <laughs> no. I mean, that's what, no. 2000, 90, that's 95? That's a slap in the face. Yeah, they're gonna, they're, gonna, they're gonna fly over you, and they're gonna fly by, and they're gonna land in the, uh, what is that, Max 5? Oh, is Max that, 5, Is yeah. that the new, that's the new one, right? And then the uh, Mossy Oak version is the what? Uh, you don't uh, even know anymore. No, Moss, I don't. They got, they got it all. They have a, they have a bunch of so we take it. Gonna breast it out. You clean most puddle ducks like this, huh? Yep. Pretty much the majority of them. Diving ducks, you almost have to fillet the skin off the duck because it's so tough. But you just push it with your thumbs down in it until you get down. Pull the skin off the meat like that. Real easy. Get your knife. Just put it in and run right next to this bone right here. It's like a breastbone. Just cut down until it stops. You just fillet it off. You go from the front or the back, Justin? How do you do it? Either or. Depends on which way the duck's facing, I guess. Or what side it is. <laughs> Park rangers probably. Right. Right. Don't shoot those on this leg. <laughs> <laughs> man, a heck of a hole you got here, man. Power plant lake. There it goes. Huh? One down. Yeah. These are like the, what do you consider this little piece? Like the back strap it's or tenderloin? tenderloin? Yeah. They're like really the hard to get out of there. Now, other people may pluck ducks completely, like gut them, pluck them. We don't do that. It's not a whole lot. Have you ever done it before? No. It's not a whole lot of meat. Actually, that one year in Anawak, I think we did pluck two till, and we cooked them on a grill. It's just not a whole, and that's what you have left. Some people will pluck them. Some people will cook their legs. I mean, there's not a lot there. I'm not saying that you can't do it, but it's... It's a lot of work and not a whole lot of yield, so if you have time, it's a good idea to do it maybe if you want to try it out, but this is what we got. There it is. That's what, good eight, old eight or teal? All, yep, all organic meat. From the field to the fork. So Justin's the chef today. He is uh, mapping us out on some teal breast that we put together. You got a half a teal breast per brochette Half a stick of half of a piece of bacon. Wrapped, correct. Wrapped piece of pineapple, some onion, and then what kind of marinade were you going with? We did a uh, steakhouse, steakhouse marinade, <laughs> steakhouse marinade. It's the only marinade we could find at Brooks Brothers that would possibly work for us. So that's uh, that's what we're working with it's, right now. It's uh, soy free, gluten free. That's what we had to go with. <laughs> Trust me, I would like a nice teriyaki. But I can't have it right now. Yeah, we're on a specialized diet, we'll call that. So uh, that's what we're rolling with. But we'll show you the finished product here in a minute. But right now, this is what we're working with. Yummy. Field to the fork. Yum. These things look magical. You did it, bro. Look at this. Teal breast a la brochette. Yum. So, ah, oh, dang it. I'm trying to make this happen on this paper plate without punching a hole Sorry. in it. Check this out. 
Medium rare, bro. It's really good, dude. It's medium rare. It's good. It's the way it should be done. So, keys to cooking this? What are you thinking? Uh, New marinade. Guy out the gate. Definitely marinade. Well, you brined them too. Soaked them in water for about 12 hours, then rinsed, then marinated for another five or six hours with a good marinade. It's all in the preparation when you cook ducks. There, there's, is it just is the denture meat that more blood in the breast or I what is so. it? I think so. Yeah. I mean, they're red. Yeah. Really red. Red, yeah. red, red. And after you, after you soak them for a day in water, it they turn almost a gray color because all that blood gets out. A lot of that game will go with it. And so you're left with a nice piece of meat. Yeah, this is magical. So bacon, half a slice of bacon, piece of chunk of pineapple, onion, and it is unbelievable. And don't overcook it. Medium rare. Medium rare. Thank you guys so much for watching the video today. We really appreciate it. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give us that thumbs up button up there. Let us know that you liked it. Also, be sure to subscribe to our channel. That way you can keep up to date with every single thing we've got going on this season. And while you're there, ring that bell. The bell's gonna give you a notification every single time we post a video. That way you guys can definitely stay in the know of what's going on here. If you wanna keep up with us on our social media platforms, please do. We've got Facebook, Snapchat, and Instagram. So that's all we've got for today, but we've got a lot more coming up throughout the season. So until next time, we'll see you soon. Bye.